Alrighty. Well, look at today. It's foggy. It's overcast. It's I don't know what you want to call this. I call it high fog. You look out there, and it's much colder than just the other day when I was out. And uh, today what I'm going to try to do is I'm going to a totally different area. I'm sure local people will know where I'm sort of at. And I'm going to do a mix of lures and float rig. I'm just going to see what it's like or see what goes on. I might fish a creek. I might do anything. But what I'm not doing is I'm not going out to the inlet or anything like that. I'm not fishing the jetties because uh, it's kind of 10 to 15 out of the north. I didn't want to have to fight it, you know. Um, so that's the agenda for today. Let's see what happens. Fish number one took the first cast. And let's see what it is. Whoa! Challenge met. It's a fish. But it's a blue fish on a usury. Oh boy, oh boy. I'm just casting where the birds are. Oh boy, oh boy, the green scourge, well, I, that was at least first cast, alright, well, hey, the birds are diving around here so I figured I'd give it a shot. Alrighty, this is what I was afraid of coming down here, DOA shrimp. New penny, if we're going to get all fancy in colors, I just go dark or light. But there's a dark one with white eyes. And a little dinker trout. I'm getting pounded by these one after another. I kind of gave up on the bluefish. They were just killing that dang Yozuri minnow. So, we got to do something about this get some bigger trout. Alrighty. The tide must be getting right. I just got me another one here. Yep, looks like she's going to be a keeper. Barely a keeper. Maybe a keeper. Probably not a keeper. <laughs> ah, there we go. Whew. Tough, 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 tough fishing. Oh, she's good enough for government work. Okay, I think I got the biggest trout of the day on right now. I got this pelican who's harassing me. Nope. It's a pup red. Yep. Ain't gonna be big enough. Nice little fish, but... Again, not the reason we're out here. 
Alright, hey, you're getting rained on. If you look real hard right on that branch right there, there's Ozzy the Osprey. He's He's too cold and wet to want to move. So he's just sitting there looking at me. Well, check it out. Sitting here in the rain. And I got me a yellow mouth trout on a jig set up just like the butterfly jig. All right, got them right underneath the, but guess what? That's not even metal. That's hard plastic. One of my eBay China finds. So, he'll go in the box. And uh, join my other two small speckly trout. Yeah, we're killing them out here today. You know, you think Mr. Osprey there would be a whole lot smarter than sit out in the rain. <laughs> Listen to me. Yeah, like like I'm smarter. I'm sitting out here in the rain. Well, it's it's on and off raining. All right, just pitching that old spoon, a uh, slab spoon, micro jig, whatever you want to call it. Casting it out to the channel here in the intercoastal waterway and just popping it off the bottom. I'd like to get some more specs. Why is it always so much better when you get back to the boat ramp? Well, that was an afternoon. Why does it always seem so much better when you get to when you get back to the boat ramp? I get back to the boat ramp and it's not raining. <clears throat> and it feels warmer. Yeah, it was a crappy day, but I'll tell you something. I must have caught 20, 30 fish. I just only came home with three keepers. So, I mean, talk about small speckled trout. Oh my God, I caught, I caught them from like, you know, the third cast. I caught a uh, bluefish on the first cast. But, um, yeah, I mean, that's the funny thing. Even in the winter, you know, it's, I mean, today was a crappy day. I think I just went out to prove a point to myself because I just, I just wanted to do something, you know. So, um, yeah, I mean, I caught fish. The float rig was just smoking them. But there were no big ones, not where I was, and. I wasn't about to go traipsing around all over the place either. I stuck in one area that was probably a quarter mile long. <laughs> so that's that story. On a crappy day, you can still go out in the winter, especially if you got a float rig, and you're most likely still gonna catch fish. It always cracks me up when somebody says, have you ever gone out and been totally skunked? And I'm like, not really. I mean, targeted species can be tough to come by, but we're always catching something. So the moral of the story is, is it was raining, it was foggy, the temperature dropped like 20 degrees, and, um, Still caught fish, so there you go.